Hi, my name is Jerome Jackson, and I'm very proud to say that I first joined the Drifters over 25 years ago. I'm also proud to say that I'm back and reunited with some of the greatest Drifters ever for our first world tour in a number of years. So, sit back and relax and watch some clips from our brand new show and some historic moments from the Drifter shows of the past. Dating back to Dick Clark's American Bandstand, the Drifters have made over 50 appearances on national TV, including Tonight Show, The David Letterman Show, Saturday Night Live, Midnight Special, and an annual appearance on Jerry Lewis Telephone. Right and your shoes get so hot, wish your tired feet were fireproof. The music industry gave the Drifters the ultimate honor Induction into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, fellow Hall of Famer Mick Jagger, Bob Dylan, and Bruce Springsteen joined them on one of their classics. Here they are doing a special performance for the Clintons at their inaugural ball. After the tragic events of 9-11, the Drifters organized the historic Stand Up America Tour and were asked by Major League Baseball to perform at ballparks throughout America. The Drifters, along with the Platters and the Coasters, headlined the longest running sold out show in Las Vegas history over 10 years at the Sahara Hotel. Two hundred and fifty Rolling Stone critics have recognized the Drifters as one of the top five rock groups of all time. And now you can hear them perform their greatest songs live. It's a show filled with classic after classic. It will be almost impossible to believe that one group could be responsible for so many songs. I thought the show was great. I loved every minute. I brought my mom. Reuniting for their first national tour in years and bringing back some of their greatest past members, the Drifters are indeed back. Yeah. 